Yo, what's happening, fam? James Incognito here. Yes, sir. So uh, we are over at Roscoe's Chicken and Waffles, Inglewood, California, my boy. So the uh, 405 freeway is uh, right over there. And um, man, if you're ever on the 405 uh, going south or going north, and uh, you, you're, you're passing up the uh, Manchester exit, bruh, get off and come get some Roscoe's, my boy, because uh, their food is fire. Let's go. So let's take a look at the Roscoe's menu. Yes, sir. So check this out, fam. They also serve breakfast, but um, I'm not here for breakfast today. What I'm here for is the chicken and the straight waffle. All right, so, uh, but let's take a look at some of their uh, their orders. All right, so let's take a look at number one, Sko's um, Quarter Chicken Prepared Southern Style. Two waffles, our own private mix. So Southern Style, uh, I think they put the gravy on. Oh, no, this is it. Sko's Quarter Chicken Smothered with Gravy and Onions. Two waffles, our own mix. Yeezer. So the gravy here is also delicious. But for today, I really don't want to order the gravy. I just want some crispy chicken and the sweet waffle. Let's look at some more orders. All right, I mean, um, combos. So they have, they've got Gene, John Jones, Gene Jones omelet, combination of cheese and chicken with delicious, delicious omelet served with french fries or waffle. So they've got definitely a bunch of different uh, styles that you can order. Obama special, three wings. Waffle or potato salad. Number 10, fresh chicken livers. I'll pass on that. Number 11, giblets. Rice, gravy, and onions with hot biscuit. Eee, new year. Uh, number 12, getting a little better. Chicken salad. Uh, special chicken salad plate or sandwich with tomato, lettuce with french fries or something. We're here for the number 13, guys. That uh, Carol C special. Basically, one breast, one waffle, and I'm going to add a side of a chicken wing. As far as the drinks are concerned, I'm gonna order the Eclipse and the Sunrise. Let's go. All right, guys, let's start off with the drinks. So uh, we've got the uh, Sunrise right here, and uh, this is the Eclipse, baby. So I think the uh, Sunrise has tang and lemonade in it, and then the uh, Eclipse has Kool-Aid and lemonade. I'm telling you, these two drinks are busting, my boy. All right, guys, so I normally would have eaten inside, but because of copyright reasons. Hey, look, the airplane. We in Inglewood, California, baby. Sheesh. All right, so check this out. Because we are, uh, because of the copyright reasons, uh, had to eat outside. All right, so we just go eat on the uh, pickup truck. Let's see what the uh, chicken and waffles look like. Ooh, we. Oh, we let's go. So I ordered a number. Uh, I think this is a 13 with just a wing. So basically a uh, waffle. All right. We're going to move that waffle right there. Oh, we missed it a little bit. That's cool. And then uh, we got a wing. The wing is looking nice. Brr. And then we also got a breast. All right. The breast is looking delicious. All right, yes sir. Now the uh, waffle, bro, smells like cinnamon, bro. It smells like, it smells like you're at the uh, county fair. You know what I mean? Let's see what else we got in here. So we got a couple syrups. All right, ketchup. I need for my chicken. All right, what is this? That's probably some hot sauce. Yeah, some hot sauce, G. I don't know about that. And then we got some butter. Fork. Spoon. All right, y'all. Let's put the butter and syrup on the uh, waffle. And uh, let's put this food to work. Get the butter all lathered up. Definitely starting to cool down some, so need to eat this 
ASAP, baby. Yo, how many of you guys uh, at home use a lot of syrup, bro? I mean, I'm, I'm all in on the syrup, G. Give me all of it, bro. Yes, sir. Ooh-wee. Oh, we got a little bit of that in there. Not a problem. All right, guys. It's going to be loud. You know what I'm saying? Uh, we're sitting right under the airplane path in Inglewood, California. LAX planes. All the planes are landing at LAX. Straight down that way, my boy. And then we're in the back parking lot of the... Uh, restaurant so hopefully you know sounds kind of loud but whatever we here to eat you know what i'm saying all right so let's go in on the uh waffle first bro the waffle is definitely cooled off some bro. bro that tastes like a funnel cake so good Definitely on the cooler side. It's no longer warm, so it just took a second, you know. But it was delicious. Alright. Let's go in on this breast. Now, this is the uh hot sauce. This looks like a new homemade hot sauce. They usually would give like a Louisiana one. Let's see what it tastes like. Okay. Can't make up my mind on it. It's definitely spicy. Oh, man. I don't know about that. Let's go in on the ketchup. You ever put ketchup on your chicken? Hopefully the chicken is cooled down just like the, uh, oh yeah, like the waffles. So I can just take a big bite out of this thing. Bro. Oh, wee. Put some more ketchup on the chicken. All right, y'all, so the crunch. Crunches out. Really good. Not oily at all. Not greasy. Looks like my my fingernails painted red. Yeah. So juicy. Still warm. That's what we do. Chicken, waffle. Take that bite. Bro. Beverage time. All right, you guys. We're going to go on the um, eclipse first. Or the sunrise. Sunrise. Just the one with the orange. I'll get the exact ingredients when I get home. Forgot what they are, but I think, like I said, it's tang and lemonade. Ooh. Yeah, that's what it tastes like. Perfect. Ooh. All right, let's continue beating up this chicken. On the chicken? I would normally get two waffles, but bro, the dough tastes like a soft ice cream waffle cone, bro. Delicious. Sweet. Um, so the 
do have a few locations. Long Beach, California. LA, California. Inglewood, California. So, chicken just off the chain, bro. Juicy. It's getting a little warm with this fleece on, bro. Yum, yum, yum. Off with the fleece. No fleece, baby. Bro, watching the airplane fly, fly by is kind of cool. It is loud, though. Because they got some homes on this side and some apartments, bro, but them planes coming overhead. Shit. They definitely loud. All right, y'all, let's go in on that spicy chili, bro. Oh, no. Normally they would give us like a, I thought it was like a Louisiana hot sauce burn, but let's just dip. Dip away. Definitely got a, um, a punch to it. I ain't messing with it. That was it. Need the ketchup. I don't know, bro. Let's see what this wing, what's up this wing, man? Mm, bro. This thing fell apart. on that drumlet. All right, y'all. Let's go ahead and test out the uh, Eclipse. So like I said, I think this one's got a uh, Kool-Aid lemonade mix. Oh yeah. It might be fruit punch. Not Kool Aid, but it's kind of like a Arnold Palmer, but Palmer, but juice instead of the um, unsweetened lemonade or tea, or whatever it is. Anyways, which one do we like the best? Sunrise, Eclipse. Sunrise is definitely on the um, a little more sour side. Still sweet. And the red one's more of just literally fruit punch lemonade mix. So which one would y'all get? Red? Yellow. I'm going to have to go with the yellow. It's got a little bit more sour to it. The Eclipse. All right, you guys, so the uh, chicken and waffles was delicious. You know what I'm saying? I really like the chicken here because they've got a nice crunch to it, you know, and the uh, the uh, whatever they use, the, the flour that they put on it, bro, it's super, super tasty, too. So it's crunchy, tasty, no spice at all. The, uh, the waffle, fire. The only thing that uh, was wrong with it today was it was, it was a little cold. It took me a second to, you know, get it and set set up here and get going. But uh, that thing was delicious. You know what I forgot to get, though, bro? Forgot to get the mac and cheese. They've got a bunch of sides here that are also delicious that I didn't get to today. So maybe I'll come back next time and um, also get... They also serve the fried chicken smothered. 
so you can get it with like this gravy sauce instead of it being dry. So maybe next time we come out here, we'll get the smothered chicken with the mac and cheese and see how that goes. But in the meantime, hopefully you guys can get to uh, a Roscoe's chicken and waffle. The wa waffle and the chicken combination sounds kind of crazy if you've never had it, but it actually works really well with the sweet and the salty. Also, there's so many, are there? chicken and waffle places uh this just happens to be one of the more popular ones like in in, in los angeles or you know or even california maybe just because we're not known for chicken and waffles so if you guys uh anywhere in the country know of a fire chicken and waffles place please put their name in the um, comment section that way i can check them out and i don't know maybe someday i'll be able to fly out you know what i mean go eat there so, hopefully you guys enjoyed the vlog. Make sure to like, subscribe, and share. We'll catch you guys soon. Let's go. Yes, sir.